get your dream job with chennai race institute study the following information carefully and answer the questions point v is 4 meters north of point t point m is 3 meters south of point k point v is 4 meters east of point m point t is 6 meters east of point s let's see the solution here they given that point v is 4 meters north of point t here this is point t and point v is 4 meters north to point t next statement point m is 3 meters south of point k here this statement is not related to diagram skip the statement and go to the next statement point v is 4 meters east of point m here this is point m and point v is 4 meters east of point m let's see the solution next statement point t is 6 meters east of point s here this is point s and point t is 6 meters east of point s last statement point m is 3 meters south of point k here this is point k and point m is 3 meters south of point k so this is the final diagram so let's see the questions on the diagram first question what is the direction of point t with respect to point k the options are a southwest b southeast c northwest d northeast and e none of these let's see the solution here in the question they are asking that what is the direction of point t with respect to point k in this diagram we clearly observe that point t is in the direction of south and east with respect to k that means the direction of point t is southeast with respect to point k so the answer is option b southeast second question if point h is 2 meters west of point k then what is the distance between point h and s the options are a 8 meters b 6 meters c 7 meters d 5 meters and e none of these let's see the solution here they given that point h is 2 meters west of point k means this is point h and point h is 2 meters west of point k in the question they are asking that what is the distance between point h and s in this diagram we can observe that distance between point h and point s is equal to the distance between point k and point m plus distance between point v and point t so distance between point k and point m is 3 meters and distance between point v and point t is 4 meters so distance between point h and point s is 3 plus 4 that is 7 meters so the answer is option c 7 meters Join today in Chennai Race Institute and learn from the experts. Thanks for watching.